All right, lads, BSP are you? Big sip of beer review. And today's review, we're going to look at this Pilsner. It's called, I might butcher it, Flensburger Pilsner. We're coming in at 4.8% in a 500ml can. This I bought from House of Trembling Madness. And yeah, not much to say. It's all in German. And all I know is a German Pilsner. I do like um, a Pilsner. I do like a lager. And everyone knows how good Germany are at brewing their lagers and their Pilsners. So we'll have a look at it. Hopefully this is going to be... A belter. Yeah, they're really, really good Germany at them. Um, at the the lagers and they know this stuff. I haven't done many German lagers on the channel. I've done a few, but not many. Yeah, I don't I don't know I do not know a lot about this at all. So let's have a look at it, is it? Got a little bit more left in it. So we are a quite a pale looking lager with a one and a half finger white dead and we've got slow yeah slow carbonation rise up a glass um, and the aroma slight bit of malts and there's a bit of um, there's a bit of honey going on there, on this one as well. Smells alright, smells quite decent. Flensburger Pilsner. Chin chin old buddy, let's have a go. Nice clean soft mouth feel. No carbonation. When, as you can see, it's very little in the glass. None at all as you taste it. Nice clean soft mouth feel. I pick up the um bit of the malts on the um on the smell. It's definitely that on the taste. There's an element of honey as well. Am I just saying that because I smelt it? No, there is. There's a little bit of honey in there. <sighs> Malts. A little bit of honey now. And then you've got a slight hoppy bit to finish as well. Yeah, it's very, very nice. Easy to drink. Um, well impressed with it, really. Look at that. I, <laughs> 500 ml can. Oh, we have got a little bit left. Not much. Easy to drink. It's refreshing. Um, it's clean, soft in the mouth. Quite flavoursome. I've just checked the invoice from the box of um, House of Trembl Trembling Madness. <coughs> Pardon me. Carbonated. And this was £2.10. So one of the cheapest um, beers we ordered. And one of the best. £2.10 for a German Pilsner. Can't beat it. And it's a good German Pilsner. Yeah. Malty. Slight bit of honey taste. A hoppy bit of finish as well. Good Pilsner. Let's have a look at Big Sip. Ooh, I put my teeth in Big Sip. Let's have a look at Big Sip Bolton ability. <sighs> really good Pilsner. If I ever do an order, or I will, we, are, we will be ordering again because it was just dribbled ender if you pick that up. <laughs> Uh, we will be ordering from House of Trembling Madness again. Um, again, it was I ordered. I did explain on my um, 
on my video. We ordered the one day at 12 o'clock, midday, and then the next day, come 9 o'clock in the morning, it was your fantastic service. Um, all the beer's been quite good. Well, I'm saying quite good. Mostly, mostly been fantastic. Um, yeah, this was another one. £2.10, like I said, the cheapest one in the box. Um, and it's a fantastic German Pilsner. I'm going to give it a big sip rate. Um, it's probably an 8 out of 10. Yeah, it's really good. Um, it's an 8 out of 10 for Big Sip or Big Sip Rate. Cheers, lads. More views to come on a future date. Big Sip.